below. I jump on here and talk about a couple of books that I like uh, while I take my hair down and get real, take my hair down and uh, get relaxed. So um, let's talk about those books. Um, <laughs> so first and foremost, I wanted to uh, give a shout out to this new book that I got, um, The Subtle Art of Not Giving a Fiznik by Mark Manson. This book kind of has stoic principles, which if you don't know, stoicism is deeply rooted in psychology and um, like CBT therapy. Uh, and it is extremely helpful uh, for getting out of depression, anxiety. Um, CBT is almost used across the board in all talk therapy type of psychological, uh, you know, psychotherapy. I don't want to say, well, yeah, I'm like psychotherapy. Um, in almost all psychotherapy type of situations, CBT therapy is used. And that was um, originated kind of from stoic principles. And it helps everything from, like I said, um, anxiety, depression, to uh, also mood disorders and personality disorders, as well as uh, PTSD and trauma uh, disorders. So there's a plethora, and also phobias. So there's a plethora of different um, things that it helps with. Now, what I, that's not what I got on here to talk about, but I think that stoicism, I'm glad to see that it is taking a front seat in our society and kind of like in the mainstream narrative a little bit. Um, I think that's amazing that it's making kind of like a rebirth. Uh, nevertheless, what I wanted to jump on here and talk about because I saw so many comments about religion and spirituality and um, are centered around different religions, spells, witchcraft, um, asking my religion, uh, Abrahamic traditions, Christianity, um, Judaism, and things like that. So I wanted to touch on that. And um, one person who really gave me a good piece of advice uh, was Thomas Sheridan. And that is a content creator here on YouTube. And I will link his information down below. He has three channels. Um, one is Open Source Occult TV. One is Thomas Sheridan. And the other is a new channel that I cannot always remember what the name of it is. But um, I will link that down below as well. So he gave me some very great advice a few years back. And that was to start out my spiritual journey, if I didn't know where I was headed, to go ahead and go with Carl Jung, Man and His Symbols, and Joseph Campbell, The Hero with a Thousand Faces. This wasn't the first time that I had been given advice like this, though. Um, Freeman Fly, which I will also link down below, mentioned this book a million times. And so... <laughs> Um, when I heard him say these two, I was like, I have to, I have to get these because I had already ordered this because of Freeman and I will link Freeman down below as well. Freeman fly one word and he does Freeman TV. Um, so anyways, uh, but the channel here on YouTube is actually called Freeman fly. Um, and those two gentlemen have helped me amazingly. Now, Thomas Sheridan is a uh, pagan. Excuse me, I'm going to change this music. <laughs> Sorry, I thought I'd picked some good music, but apparently not. Um, I'm trying to avoid copyright strikes. So, we will see. No. We will see here. How about this?
There we go. I don't want lyrics. Okay. So, anyway, um, <laughs> sorry about that. Uh, so we've only been going not that long. Let me grab one more book, though, that I would like to, um, introduce you guys to. Whoa. I thought there were supposed to be no lyrics on this. Okay, I'm turning it off. Uh, anyways, sorry about the music. Uh, I'll get that fixed. Um, so this is The Secret Teachings of All Ages by Manly P. Hall. And this is, this is a must. And again, I will link Freeman TV down below because he did turn me onto this as well. And I think that these are some... If you're going to get started down the spiritual path or down the mysticism path or even down whatever path you go, even Abrahamic tradition, I think it's very important to uh, bear in mind um, our mind, our psyche, and the archetypes that exist out there and how they interact with our mind. Uh, because it was Socrates who first said, know thyself, and from there you can build. And I think that that is so important and so true. Um, anyways, you guys, that's all I really have for now. Um, I'm still editing the Allegory of the Cave video. I haven't gotten very far with it because I need some new... Uh, I don't need anything. <laughs> I just need uh, to figure out how to use what I have. <laughs> and... Uh, so that being said, I just need a little bit of help, and I hope to get that done, um, to get some help, get a helping hand to kind of show me how to, like, reteach me how to do some of this stuff that I've, like, kind of lost my touch with as far as editing and all of that goes. Um, maybe this break, this winter break um, from school and all that. So I hope to, uh, to be able to do that then. And again, I'm so sorry about the music. Uh, we'll get there. <laughs> I was just kind of doing this last minute, and I was hoping to have some nice, chill background music, and I didn't realize that that song was only a minute long. But um, And then it started some other craziness. But remember, The Secret Teachings of All Ages, Manly P. Hall, Man and His Symbols by Carl Jung, The Hero with a Thousand Faces by Joseph Campbell. These are three must-haves for, like, spiritual, uh, your spiritual journey, because it'll help you to kind of know yourself and um, kind of assess what you're about to read in all these different traditions. And um, that's my opinion, at least. And um, it's not just mine. I will go ahead, because I don't want to take credit for that. Um, that was advice given to me here on YouTube, and I will link those guys down below. So, anyways, um, let me know when a good time this week would be for you guys to do a live stream interaction with me. Um, I want to start doing a live stream once a week. I want to pick a day and time that would work best for everybody. So, please let me know down below when a good time would be. And if you have any questions or topics that you would like to kind of touch on during that time. And, um... And if you have any critiques or advice, uh, let me know. If you would like to, as I said, do a um, do any type of collaboration, let me know. And I hope you guys have a great meal next week. I hope you have a great uh, celebration with your families. And um, I hope you have a great holiday next month. But I will touch base with you before that because next week I really would like to jump on here and start my weekly uh, live streams. So let's down below comment and let me know when you think would be the best time and day to do those live streams. All right, you guys. Well, I hope you guys are having a wonderful evening and I'll talk to you later. Good night.